In an age of global positioning satellites and instant wireless communications, tracking aircraft in oceanic airspace remains hampered by limited air traffic control surveillance. In the coming years, advances in surveillance technology will change how aircraft are monitored in oceanic airspace, resulting in a quantum leap in airspace efficiency, fuel savings, and reductions to greenhouse gas emissions. Currently, close to 1,200 aircraft a day carry passengers and cargo across the North Atlantic, making it the busiest oceanic corridor in the world. Because ground-based surveillance is limited to coastal areas, aircraft are managed using air traffic control rules that require large spacing between them. For this reason, traffic over the North Atlantic follows highly structured routes known as the North Atlantic Track System. The tracks are developed based on a number of factors, the most important being the jet stream. Tracks to Europe use the jet stream to their advantage by routing along the strongest tailwinds, reducing jet fuel consumption. The tracks from Europe to North America are designed to avoid the headwinds caused by the jet stream. The tracks are designed to maintain lateral separation of one degree, which is approximately 60 nautical miles. Aircraft following on the same track must be spaced 10 minutes apart, approximately 80 nautical miles from the aircraft in front of them. Vertical separation of 1,000 feet must be maintained between aircraft above or below. As they transit the ocean, aircraft provide position reports of their actual locations, either through data link or voice. Air traffic controllers use those position reports to monitor and manage traffic in the airspace, the aircraft track is then projected based on their known speed and altitude until the next position report is received. This highly structured environment provides little flexibility for pilots to request changes to altitudes and speeds or make adjustments to their route. But that is all about to change. In 2018, a new satellite constellation will provide seamless coverage to the entire globe. ADSB units on board each satellite will receive position reports from aircraft and continuously transmit those signals to air traffic controllers, enabling aircraft to be tracked in areas currently without surveillance. Space-based ADSB will revolutionize the way air traffic is managed over oceans and in remote areas of the world. It will enable air traffic controllers and airlines to optimize air operations in these areas. This new capability is ideally suited to enhancing the efficiency of flights transiting the busy North Atlantic. With positive surveillance data on aircraft location, air traffic controllers will be able to permit flights to safely fly closer together like they do in domestic airspace. Controllers will have the ability to offer more flexibility to pilots to fly direct routes or to adjust their path en route to avoid significant weather or better take advantage of the winds. When space-based ADSB is available in 2018, full and continuous surveillance will have a dramatic impact on how transatlantic air traffic is managed. The result will be a quantum leap in customer benefits with increased safety, big fuel savings, and substantially reduced greenhouse gas emissions. This is just one of the many ways in which NAV Canada is leading positive change and making improvements to its services in order to deliver value to the people behind each and every one of those flight movements, our customers and their passengers, the flying public.